Hello! Sa araw na ito, ako ay aawit ng original composition. Isasummarize ko po ang love story naming mag-asawa sa isang awitin. Nawa magustuhan po niya at nawa mag-willy din po kayo sa pakikinig. Kuya Pastor, ang tawag sa iyo ng alam. Ella Gumamela, ang tawag mo sa akin, naalala mo pa ba? Yung library, na naging library. Naging Mrs. Tree in the end I was five when I first saw you I was 18 years old When I saw you again I was 20 years old When you courted me I was 23 When you said I do with me You were just 36 then So much stories to tell filled with love never changing Far, far, funny and faithful friends So much stories to tell filled with love never changing Pagsasama natin, ikaw ang patawa, ikaw ang matalino, ikaw ang malakas, pero hindi bali na basta't mahal kita, makin man ang daindi, kayo ay magsasama sa ating pamilya, salamat sa galak, sa bawat mga puyat, sa sipag at syaga, lahat ng dumi. Mo sa akin sa bigay na allowance ni pambili ng gusto ko o pang online shopping. Habang ako'y mahilig na mamahalin kita sa biyayan ng Diyos, tayo namang dalawa kasama ng mga bata, bagong baby. Huwag mo na, huwag mo na.
ganun talaga. <laughs> yan po ang aming love story in just one song. At patuloy pa po yan na isusulat ni Lord for the rest of our lives. Napaka-exciting yung ginagawa ng Panginoon. Alam niyo po sa araw na ito, may natanggap po akong mensahe. Ang sabi niya, ang saya daw ng aming pamilya. Sabi ko, wow, glory to God. Sa totoo lang po, ang batayan ng mundo ng happiness is based on material things or based on the things that you have. Well, I'm happy because I have a family. But beyond that, I have the joy in my heart. We don't have a house. We, we don't have our own house. We don't have our own car. We don't have uh, much of this world to offer. Pero, masasabi ko po na I'm satisfied with my family. You know what? When we satisfy ourselves in our families, we begin to appreciate what we have. We begin to smile. We begin to be happy. We begin to have our hearts filled with joy. Sapagkat po, pag nakikita natin kung anong meron tayo, dun po tayo nagiging masaya. Pag tinitignan natin yung wala tayo, dun po tayo nalulungkot. So, for us to have a happy family, first of all, let's appreciate the members of our family. Let's appreciate that we have parents. Let's appreciate that we have siblings, mga kapatid. Okay, and in that case, we can have the joy in having a happy family. Actually, ang joy ay nagmumula sa relationship natin sa Panginoon. Kaya walang kwenta ang ating relationship sa pamilya kung wala po tayong relationship sa Panginoon. Because first of all, it's a gift of God. It's the fruit of the Holy Spirit. Galatians 5.22 Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control, love, and joy. It comes from the Lord. So if we have that from our relationship with the Lord, then we can just make it overflow in our families. So makikita po yan, hindi lamang sa social media, but in our private lives, we can enjoy our uh, families. Kung may asawa ka, kung meron kang mga anak, kung wala kang mga anak, kung meron kang mapagmahal na asawa, well, you are blessed. And those are reasons for you to be happy. Kung wala kang asawa, meron kang anak, your children are blessing from the Lord. You still have the reason to be happy. First of all, secure ourselves with the joy that comes from the Lord. And when the joy from God fill our hearts, surely it will overflow. Aapaw po yan. Usually, makikita po yan hindi lamang ikaw, kundi ng ibang tao. So if you want to have a happy family, First of all, you receive the joy that comes from the Lord, let it overflow in your heart, and let it manifest in your family for others to witness, to others, for others to see, and they shall also be inspired with your happiness. Okay, God bless you. May the Lord give you the joy to enjoy your families. God bless you today. See you in our next vlog.